To what extent did the battle against the Quincy's alter the Bleach world? In addition to the loss of incredible personnel, such as the likes of Unohana, the Death Sword, Genryosai, the Court Guard founder, and Ukitake, who housed the Flesh of the Reio, in the upcoming years, Hell would begin to spill over into the rest of reality. Owing to the disappearance of powerful Reiatsus, including the likes of Sosuke Aizen and Yuhats, and the transference of powerful souls to the Infernal Realm, including the likes of Genryusai Yamamoto, but there were other consequences. Thanks to the explosive battles of the Thousand Year Blood War, the ground was left heavily scorched. The First Division barracks suffered heavy losses and almost complete destruction. The Soul Reaper Academy also suffered heavy losses, including the lives of countless lecturers who died at the hands of the Quincy soldiers. But the lives of many academics were spared thanks to the efforts of Lieutenant Mashiro Kuna. Head Captain Kyoraku also proposed that gifted individuals like Yoroichi Shihoin offer lectures on Hakuda and Shunpo, given the shortage of teachers. Moreover, the Gotei 13 lost approximately half of its soldiers. Unbeknownst to the vast majority of soldiers and citizens of Soul Society, Yuha's corpse was used as a linchpin of the world, as it conveniently contained the remains of the Reio's power. Lieutenant Kotetsu was hastily appointed the role of Captain of Squad 4 in the absence of Captain Unohana, and the placement of new captains and lieutenants shouldn't come as a surprise, as the restoration of the Gotei's power was paramount. Furthermore, given that Ichibe Hyosube stole a hundred knights from Soul Society's future, to construct this grand mausoleum, the inhabitants of the Soul Society will likely have to experience a hundred days without knights over a 100 year period at some point in Soul Society's future. Like, follow and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more.